Hello everybody. So I'm back out in my shop and uh, you saw me do that previous video. I showed you uh, how to clean up the mushrooming on the pole. This turned out really nice. Got it all nice and sharp. Um, I got a 28 inch handle in that thing. Really nice. <clears throat> nice beautiful grain and uh, the eye wood <clears throat> closed the gap really nice it's really nice and tight uh, one thing I wanted to show is the biggest mistake we see is people will cut their wedge um, only as big as the eye wood sticking out um, you've got to you've got to clear clear the gaps up here where the where it's fat that's nice and tight you're always gonna have, well, not always, but when you do, you should have your gap out here where it's skinny and your wedge is gonna make up for that. So anyhow, I've got a, uh, a wedge ready to go. Got a little bit of glue on it. Doesn't take much. Little dab will do you. <clears throat> so I got my trusty rubber mallet. And a lot of times when you're pounding your wedge in, you want to make sure that it's not making curls on this side. Sometimes it, get, it gets to be a little bit big over here. And at this point, at about the halfway point before I start welling on it, um, I will, I'll uh, take my knife and I'll clean that up. Otherwise these things are gonna, uh, you know, they're gonna bottom out. They're gonna bottom out right here and snap. So any, anyhow, um, Now this is walnut. Uh, walnut is is fairly brittle, uh, so I, I want to make sure that I'm not hitting it too hard, um, so it, it doesn't snap. So that's about where I like it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to cut it off with my bandsaw, and then I will probably put. Uh, a dowel wedge in instead of a metal step wedge so anyhow yeah once i shut this video off i'll probably hit on this again uh so but you know you really want that thing to be wedged um wedged really tight and we you know nowadays modern way to hang these it, we live it a little bit proud and what that's going to do is that that's going to kind of v out and it's really going to lock that head on there so anyhow, you guys get out into your shop and uh, play around a little bit. Have a good one. Bye.